Welcome back to The Guru. Today I'm going to show you a really cool new update that allows teachers in Google Classroom to push a website to all of the users in their class. So if you're in a class and you want all of the students in that class to go to the same website, rather than send them a link and hope that they click it, or even worse, write a URL on the board and pray that they type it in the right way, you can just click a button and send the website to all of their devices and it will pop up in Chrome right in front of them. It's really cool and I'll show you how it works right now. So the first step is to go to the Chrome Web Store and we're going to search Share to Classroom. And found it right down here. We'll click Add to Chrome. Add extension. And you can see this little icon now exists up next to the URL bar. So let's say we want to send everyone in an English class that we are the teacher of to theguru.com because we want them to subscribe to Google Apps Tips and Tricks and use some of the docs tips for their English assignments. So what we'll do is we'll click on this little icon up here. And we can choose which class we want to push to. It'll pull up all the classes that we're a teacher in. We'll click English. And it pulls up the page we are on. We can select Push to Students. But another cool thing here before we push is you can actually do your other Google Classroom tasks right from here without actually going to the Google Classroom interface. So you can make an announcement or you can create an assignment. And it will also push this site to them as you do that. So we're just going to push this site to the students and we'll click Push. And you can see that the site has been pushed to students. And then you can also see um, which sites have been pushed to you from students. They can push sites back to you. It's important to note that the students will have to have this extension installed in order to receive the site you're pushing to them, but you can install this domain-wide on Chromebooks if that's what you're using for your domain, or you can just make sure it's part of the start of your curriculum to make sure that all students install this extension when they start the school year. So this can be really helpful for keeping everyone on the same page and keeping everyone focused in a classroom setting. I hope you found this tip to be helpful. If you have any questions or comments, please leave them in the comments section below. Thank you and have a great day.